Hello everyone, this is Anuj from Gadget Geek. First of all, sorry for delay in publishing this video, and we will make sure to publish apps of the month on time from next month onwards. So here we are back with one more top 10 apps video, and today we will show you the 10 best apps you should try this month on your Android device. And guys, if you're new to our channel, then don't forget to subscribe to us and hit the bell icon and join our notification squad. So let's begin with our today's video, and as usual, we will show the apps in random order. So the first app we have in our list is the Dashlane. Dashlane is a password manager which safely store your passwords. You can save and organize password in vaults which you can protect with your fingerprint or pin. And the app is super secure and the data is fully encrypted. Adding a password is really easy and you can manually add in the app itself. Or whenever you are on the login page of any website, you will see this Dashlane bubble and from there you can add the account. You can also import your passwords which are already saved in your browser such as Google Chrome. Now let me show you how it works. So I will go to this website and as soon as I am on the login page, you will see this bubble. From here you can choose your already added user details or add for future auto login. You can also enable auto login from the settings which auto login if the app detects that you are on the login page. In the free version, you can save up to 50 passwords which is really good. Apart from the password, you have the option to save notes, info, payments and your IDs. Dashlane is free for life on your first device for my viewers and you can check it out by going to dashlane.com forward slash gadget cake. They also provide a VPN so you can browse without being tracked and access content that would otherwise be blocked. And apart from Android, the service is also available cross-platform such as you have the Chrome extension, iOS app and Windows application. Overall if you keep on forgetting your passwords or if you like me who wants things done quickly without wasting time on login pages, then definitely try out this app. And as mentioned earlier, you can try by going to dashlane.com forward slash gadget cake. And if you would like to use it on more than one device, then use the promo code gadget cake. Next app we have in our list is the Adobe Rush. Adobe Rush is a new video editing app for your phone. You can shoot, edit and share videos online from the app itself. Adobe Rush is an all-in-one app for editing and sharing videos online. There are a lot of powerful tools which let you edit videos professionally. Editing part is really easy and you can use preset colors, transitions and effects. When you open the app for the first time, the tutorial guides you how to use the app and believe me, I edit a lot of videos and I find this app really easy to use. There are built-in title templates where you can change colors, size and font according to your requirement. Overall, Adobe Rush is one of the best video editing app I have used on a smartphone. But unfortunately, it's not free and you get trial which allows you to export only 3 videos. And then it's based on subscription. Next we have in our list is the Scribble. Scribble is an animation maker app which allows you to draw animations on your images to achieve Scribble animation effect. The process is really simple, just open the image and then you can create awesome looking effects by just drawing over the image. There are a lot of free animations to choose from and the app is really easy to use. You can also customize your art brush and play around with different sizes and style. On the home page of the app, you can also see the feature designs created by other Scribble users. Some of them look really good and you will get the idea where you can use this app. The app also allows you to share your design on social media and in the free version, there will be a watermark but we have 25 promo codes for this app. And in the pro version, you will get features such as ad free experience, more animation effects and you can also hide the watermark. And if you need one, just send us an email at promos at gadgetgeek.com and we will send a promo code to the first 25 emails we receive. Next app we have in our list is the Sphera Map Wallpapers. Sphera allows you to apply beautiful map wallpapers on your phone. You choose a location, select style from the collection and apply it as a wallpaper. Initially, I thought it's not that useful, but apart from being useful, the map wallpaper also look unique. The style is minimalistic and you get this high quality wallpaper which fits perfectly on any HD, Full HD and even 4K screen. The best part which I like about this app is that it also have a specific style for AMOLED screen phones, which will definitely save battery while using the black map wallpapers. Overall, if you're looking for some unique backgrounds on a phone, then you should definitely check out this app. You can apply beautifully looking map wallpapers of your favorite location which in my opinion looks amazing. The app is not free but thanks to the developer we have 50 promo codes of this app. And if you want this app for free then send us an email at promos at gadgetgeek.com and we will send the promo codes to the first 50 emails we receive for this app. Next app we have in our list is the Sket. Sket is a simple app which helps you to manage applications on your phone. You can share and extract any user or system application in APK format. You can use the extracted APK to install it back again or send it to your friend via Bluetooth. So basically this app is really useful when you reset your phone and the first thing which bothers me a lot is installing the apps back again. 
But with this app, I can take APK backup in the SD card and reset my phone and install them back again without downloading the apps again. Overall, I find this app useful, especially for sharing apps and games with your friends. So save your mobile data and use Skit and share apps hassle-free. Next app is one more wallpaper app and is the Abstract. Abstract is designed by Hamper Solson, who is the award-winning OnePlus wallpaper artist. There are over 300 exclusive wallpapers that are only available through this app. All wallpapers in the app are available in 4K resolution and the app automatically applies the wallpaper for your device. You can get official OnePlus wallpaper made by Hempers from OnePlus 2 to the latest OnePlus 7. Apart from the OnePlus wallpapers, there are other wallpapers available in the app. These wallpaper looks colorful and vibrant, which looks pretty good on the phone. Overall, if you want to try some high quality, stunning, abstract and colorful wallpapers, then definitely download this app. Next app we have in our list is the Tor Browser. Tor Browser for Android is the official mobile browser supported by Tor Project. Tor Browser isolates each website you visit, so third-party trackers and ads can't follow you. Any cookies of the website automatically gets cleared when you are done browsing. And with this browser, you can prevent someone watching your connection or monitoring your browsing habits. The browser offers multi-layer encryption, which relays traffic and encrypts it three times as it passes over the Tor network. The network is comprised of thousands of servers, known as Tor Relays. You can also access websites through this browser, which are blocked by your ISP. Overall, Tor Browser is a perfect way to browse the internet, which will increase your privacy and reduce online footprint. Next we have in our list is the Firefox Screen Go. If you're like me who takes a lot of screenshot, then you can understand the pain of finding the right screenshot at right time. But now, thanks to this app from Firefox, you can simply organize and find all your screenshots faster. Once you set up the app, you get the shortcut grab and go button on your screen. And when you press it, it takes a screenshot of your screen. But the best part is that you can choose the category right after taking the screenshot or create a new one. And in the app, you can sort out your already taken screenshots or browse through the folders which you have created. Overall, Screenshot Go will definitely make your life easy when it comes to organizing your screenshots. Next we have in our list is the Download Navi. Download Navi is a download manager for your phone. I have tried a lot of download manager for Android and most of them either doesn't work properly or they don't support pause and resume download option. But Download Navi offers you a lot of features which allows you to download files easily. You can pause and resume downloads or download multiple files at one go. You just need to copy the URL or download link and once you open the app, the app auto recognize that you have a download link copied and then you just need to choose the location and start downloading. I find this app useful, especially downloading big files and games. And if you're on a daily data limit, then you can download some part of the file today and pause the download. And then once the data limit is reset, you can download the rest of the part. Overall, after the wonderful app Language Navy, Download Navy is one more wonderful app which we really liked from this developer. So definitely give it a try. And the last app we have in our list is the Easy DND. Easy DND offers best DND features for your Android phone. You can change different options without going through different system settings. You can enable full DND or priority, which only allows calls from priority or preferred contacts. You can also allow calls from repeated and start callers. Apart from that, you can turn off media, message, and touch sounds. Easy DND is definitely a new way of managing your DND options. And once you want to turn off the DND, Simply select the turn off full DND option and exit the app. So that's it guys, these were the top 10 Android apps to try out for the month of June. Let us know if you like any of them or your favorite app of the month in the comment section below. So that's all for now, if you like this video then please press the like button and subscribe to our channel Gadget Geek for more videos like this. Once again this is Anuj signing off and I'll see you in the next one.